usually young people my age just hang around Camps Bay or like the waterfront in town. So coming out here where we don't usually come is really eye-opening. It's really great seeing different cultures in Cape Town. We started the International Public Art Festival three years ago. The theme for 2019 was Generation Next. It's an international festival. We have international artists coming, but it also places Cape Town on the map, on the street art map, on the mural art map. It's for the public, it's for the communities, it's for the residents, it's for the people of Cape Town. The festival brings the community together in a way, like everyone's got like all these pieces. We see theirs, they see ours, then people come and want to take photos of all the art and all that. So it's quite nice. It brings all the homeowners out of the houses and to ask questions and that. So then, you know, you meet this person, they meet that person. You're like, yo, you should come see ours, look at ours, and then everyone shows photos. It's exactly what we wanted. We still think it's one of the nicest ones, so we, we're lucky that we really like what we have on our wall. The real value that IPAF and similar festivals have is that they offer a direct connection to the public and also an opportunity for unfiltered communication with the public good in mind. In a world saturated with commercial advertising, these things are really important. Salt River used to be like a bad area, a slummy kind of a place. So this kind of publicity, I hope it's going to be positive, put this on the map. International Public Arts Festival will bring more people to our community and bring more feet basically and more tourists so they'll all experience the different cultures in our community. My name is Jinan Ansali and my home has been painted at IPAF. <laughs> so Perfect.